Back in July, we received a complaint uh, about Mr. Lagori actually uh, allegedly placing a camera in a dressing room of some swimsuit models that were at a fashion show over at 230 Elm Street. Um, shortly thereafter, they came to us and advised us as to what they had discovered, and then we commenced an investigation from that point. Uh, it's in a dressing room showing uh, some of the swimsuit models actually undressing uh, and a couple of other ones that were going to undress before it was actually discovered that a live camera was actually running in the dressing room. I tried to camouflage it by putting it up on a shelf and actually putting some items over top of it so it wouldn't be that recognizable uh, to, you know, when you just walk in you just wouldn't see it. Uh, but one of the, uh, the females actually did discover it and uh, they did take action. Uh, we actually executed a search warrant uh, to retrieve any and all information that may have uh, pertained to this case and maybe other cases that we're actually still combing through to go through to see if there's anything else that there may be further charges coming. I mean, it's a clear violation of uh, someone's expectation of privacy, for sure. Um, and uh, it's just uh, something that shouldn't be done. I never had a situation like this. I mean, in, my, in, my, in this business, in the fashion business, working with 12 girls, is, there's some drama here and there, but not to this extension. And um, I want to clarify that I didn't know the guy. Uh, that was the first time I ever saw him and met him. And uh, I'm just going to have to Google anyone who comes near my, me and my models.